Hello everyone, welcome to Intigan. In this video, we will be solving one exponential equation which is 8 power x plus 27 power x over 12 power x plus 18 power x equal to 7 over 6. It is one of the math olympiad problem. So let us begin. How we will consider? I am going to write 8 power x as We can write 2 raised to the power 3 whole power x. So by the exponent property, I can write 2 raised to the power x whole power 3. This is our 8 power x. Similarly, 27 power x, I am writing directly 3 power x. 27 is 3 cube, so power will swap. So it will be written 3 power x whole power 3. 12 power x. I can write 4 into 3. 4 is 2 power 2. So it can be written as 2 raised to the power 2x or 2 raised to the power x power whole square and 3 raised to the power x. So next step we can write 2 raised to the power x whole square into 3 power x and last is 18 power x. So it is 9 times 2. So I will write 2 raised to the power x and 9 can be written as 3 square. So 3 power x whole square. Now what I am going to put, let's consider 2 raised to the power x is equal to a and 3 raised to the power x is equal to b. So equation will convert as you can see. 8 power x is 2 power x whole cube. So 8 power x will become a cube. So let me write here a cube plus 27 power x is 3 power x whole cube. 3 power x is b. So it will be b cube over 12 power x. 12 power x is 2 power x whole square. This is 12 power x. You can see a square b. Similarly, 18 power x we can write a b square equal to 7 over 6. Now, little simplification is there. a cube plus b cube. We know that a cube plus b cube. We can write a plus b a square plus b square minus ab. Let us write here. So that will be a plus b. a square plus b square minus ab over take ab common. So a plus b. 7 over 6. So let's cancel a plus b, a plus b. Now it is converting into simplest form that is a square plus b square minus ab over ab equal to 7 over 6. Now cross multiply it. So that will be 6a square plus 6b square minus 6ab equal to 7ab. In other words, if you will take away 7ab from both sides, equation will convert into 6a square plus 6b square minus 13ab equal to 0. This is our one quadratic equation for which we will find out solution. So let us write. So 6a square, 6a square minus 13ab. Let me write in the standard form plus 6b square is equal to 0. Now you can see factorization is on 6 times 6, 36. So I will write 9 times 4. So I will split this middle term as 
माइनस नाइन ए बी माइनस फोर ए बी यू कैन सी माइनस नाइन माइनस फोर माइनस थर्टीन इफ यू विल टेक द प्रोडक्ट माइनस नाइन इंटू माइनस फोर सो इट विल बी प्लस थर्टी सिक्स सो इट इज मैचिंग विथ ए एंड सी सिक्स टाइम सिक्स थर्टी सिक्स सिक्स बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू जीरो लेट मी टेक थ्री ए कॉमन सो इफ आई विल टेक थ्री ए कॉमन देन टू ए माइनस थ्री बी एंड इफ आई विल टेक माइनस टू बी कॉमन देन इट विल बी टू ए माइनस थ्री बी यू कैन चेक एनी टाइम सो अल्टीमेटली इट विल कम आउट टू ए माइनस थ्री बी एंड थ्री ए माइनस टू बी equal to 0 let us put the value of ab a was 2 raised to the power x b was 3 raised to the power x so it will be equal to if you want to write then 2a minus 3b is equal to 0 either this will hold true or 3a minus 2b is equal to 0 second equation okay That means two a will be equal to three b. Add three b to both sides, you will get two a equal to three b. And from this equation, second one, this equation, you will be getting three a equal to two b. Simple. Now put the value of a and b. A is two par x. B is three par x. So two into two par x. Is equal to three into three par x. Similarly, for second equation, I will write three into two par x is equal to two into three par x. So it will become by the exponent law, exponential law, or exponent rule. We know that if base is same, its power will add. So it will be x plus one. And here you will write. X plus one. Now come to this equation. I will write it is two x over two is equal to three power x over three. We can write same equation in this form. Now you can see it is two raised to the power x minus one by the exponent rule, quotient rule basically, and three raised to the power x minus one. So we have got two equations. Let me put in bracket this one and this one. Now see if base is not same. See two and three. Base is different. So exponent is same. X plus one, x plus one. How it is possible? It will be only possible when its exponent is equal to zero. This is the only possible way. and from the second equation again same thing i will say base is different exponent is same how it is possible once its power is zero so our ultimate solution is about to come that is from this equation our solution will be x is equal to minus 1 and from this equation our solution would be x is equal to plus 1 so we have two solution x is equal to plus 1 and x is equal to minus 1 let us verify the values x is equal to plus 1 so let's write check check for x is equal to plus 1 Okay, eight power one plus twenty seven power one over twelve power one plus eighteen power one. So that will be eight plus twenty seven thirty five. Twelve plus eighteen thirty. You can write this value as seven over six, which is our right side. So that means x is equal to one is our solution. true it is now come to x is equal to minus 1 so what we will do we will write 8 power minus 
प्लस ट्वेंटी सेवन पार माइनस वन ओवर ट्वेल्व पार माइनस वन प्लस एटीन पार माइनस वन वी हैव टू प्रूव दैट इट इज सेवन ओवर सिक्स सो आई विल राइट लेट मी राइट इन नेक्स्ट स्लाइड वन ओवर एट प्लस वन ओवर ट्वेंटी सेवन ओवर वन ओवर ट्वेल्व प्लस वन ओवर एटीन ओके सो हाउ वी विल सिंप्लीफाई सी आई विल मल्टीप्लाई फॉर कॉमन डिनोमिनेटर आई विल मल्टीप्लाई दिस बाय थ्री दिस बाय टू सो ट्वेल्व टाइम्स थ्री इज थर्टी सिक्स एटीन टाइम्स टू इज थर्टी सिक्स डिनोमिनेटर इज सेम न्यूमिनेटर वॉट विल टेक एल्सियम ओके सो ट्वेंटी सेवन प्लस एट दैट विल बी थर्टी फाइव ओवर एट टाइम्स ट्वेंटी सेवन Now come to denominator part. Three plus two, it will be five over thirty-six. Let us write in proper way. If you are dividing two fractions, it will multiply with the reciprocal of the denominator. So thirty-five over. I will write eight into twenty-seven into thirty-six over five. Now cancel five times one. Five times seven, we can cancel. Nine times three, nine times four, and I can cancel this by two. So ultimately, what is left? Seven, three, two in the denominator. That means seven over six. So x is equal to plus minus one is our exponential equation, real valued solution. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks a lot.